Hi, everybody. Welcome to English Digest. I'm Tom. Hi, I'm Stephanie. And today we're going to ask the question: Should I get laser vision correction? Okay. Remember last time we kind of showed a commercial for you,、uh -huh. or at least、uh, talked about a commercial for this AMC Vision Correction Clinic, Laser Vision Correction Clinic, and、uh, that was the commercial. But today we're actually going to try to answer this question using a little bit of information here. Is Is this kind of surgery, or is this operation suitable for you? Should you consider getting this laser vision correction surgery? Right. We're now going to talk about、uh, LASIK surgery, which is very, very popular. I know a lot of people are getting LASIK surgery. It's been around for quite a while. I would say it's been around for about forty years now, thirty-five, forty years. So they're pretty good at it. So don't be afraid to try this. Find a good, good doctor and go for it. So let's talk about this, but、uh, we'll do that after we read the entire contents of today's lesson. In my years as an ophthalmologist. Many people have asked me whether they should undergo laser vision correction. There are several aspects to this question, which I intend to answer in turn. First, there are several different kinds of laser vision correction surgery. LASIK is the most modern of these techniques. The laser is used to lift a small flap of the cornea, the transparent outer covering of the eyeball. So the tissue beneath can be reshaped. The eye heals very rapidly after the surgery, which is used to treat nearsightedness, farsightedness, and problems with focusing. Other treatments are recommended for people with thin corneas, dry eyes, or other issues. Second, as with all surgeries, there are a few risks and side effects associated with laser vision correction. Loss of vision due to an accident is extremely rare, but sometimes additional surgeries are required to fully correct the original problem. Some patients also experience dry eyes, blurred vision, and discoloration of the eye itself during the healing process. However, people can get eye infections from contact lenses too. And these do nothing to correct vision problems permanently. Overall, laser vision correction achieves a satisfactory result in more than 95% of patients, many of whom describe the outcome as life-changing. Of course, it's essential to consult an ophthalmologist before you make a final decision, but I would certainly recommend it to anyone troubled by vision problems. Okay, everybody. It's time for us to discuss the contents of today's lesson. The question is: Should I get laser vision correction? Now, remember yesterday、mm. or in our last program, I mentioned the word laser. It's an acronym for light amplification by stimulated emission of radiation. So there you go. Just in case you wanted to know, but I think it's useless for me to provide you with that information because nobody really knows.、Uh, That this word is an acronym, but basically, yes, laser is kind of a thin beam of light that is used in a lot of applications. In this particular case, I guess the laser is what does the incision in your eye, as opposed to a scalpel. Right. That sounds a little bit more、uh, tolerable to have a laser cut my eye instead of a knife, which、mm. is what a scalpel is. That sounds like a horror movie, actually.、Yeah. Especially if it's in your eye. Oh my、Ugh. goodness! There are several aspects or parts to this question,、uh, which I intend to answer in turn. If you intend to do something, it means that's what you plan on doing. So, if you answer something in turn, it just means you're going to take turns to answer it. You're going to answer it in order, you could say. So here we're actually listening to somebody who's an eye doctor, and if you have a hard time saying、uh, their title, which most people do, even Americans, just call him the eye doctor. So first, there are several different kinds of laser vision correction surgery. 
This I did not know. Now, LASIK is the only one I've heard of. I'm not an eye surgery expert. LASIK is the most modern of these techniques. Technique is a method, a way that something is accomplished or done. So LASIK, and it's in all caps because it's a brand name. You can't just say, you know, I'm the inventor of LASIK. LASIK is、uh, always seen this way. I've never seen it in lowercase. Actually, I always seen see it capitalized. So it must stand for different words. Well, it, must... it is an acronym, but I'm not going to tell you what the words stand for because <laughs> some of them are Latin. It's too hard, and I think it's、uh, pretty silly to、yeah. actually say them now because some of you will probably write it down when it's totally a useless word. So let's just say LASIK、yeah. is one of these、mm. modern techniques that is、uh, most common here for. Eye surgery using a laser. Okay, now the laser is used to lift a small flap of the cornea. Now let's talk about a flap here. That's just something that's loose、uh, on a surface that can sort of bend up. The corner of、down. something, right?、Uh, the corner of something. Flap、indeed. of a book. Uh, yes, indeed, and flap could also be a verb, like the flag is flapping in the wind.、Uh, that's a word that describes、uh, the sound of it. Or birds, birds flap, flap their, their wings. wings. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, indeed. But in this particular case, it's just a small piece of flesh、uh, that's over the cornea, and the cornea is part of your eye.、Uh, that's the transparent layer that's in front of the eye. It's the clear、mm-hmm. part of your eye、uh, that light comes through. Ooh,、uh, yeah. Transparent does mean that. If you're wearing a transparent dress, ladies, it means people can see through your skirt. That's not a good thing. You need a slip. This is a transparent outer covering of the eyeball. So the tissue, which is a very thin layer of something,、uh, you can use t- tissue to talk about layers of skin or something in your body that's a very thin layer is tissue, or sometimes. When you are wrapping presents, you can buy some really thin wrapping paper、um, that you can put into a bag instead of wrapping the gift. That's tissue paper. Tissue is also like a Kleenex that you can blow your nose on. That's a tissue. Tissue beneath it can be reshaped or reformed into another shape. The eye heals very rapidly after the surgery. Aren't our bodies amazing? That's just amazing to me. Which is used to treat nearsightedness. If you're nearsighted, it means you can see close up, but not far away. If you're farsighted, you can see far away, but not close up. And then problems.、Uh, some people have other eye problems, which amount to or are involved with focusing. Things are blurry for you. You can't really、um, see a clear picture when you look at something. Yeah, I've been told that if you play table tennis or ping pong,、uh, it helps with focusing issues、oh. because your eye is focusing on the ball far away and then coming close and going far away again. So it's good for your vision to、it's、do like that. Like exercising your eye.、Huh? In a way, indeed.、Huh. And of course, I've heard this question quite often here in Taiwan. If I'm wearing glasses, then something. Oh, Tamu, Neo Jin Shi. You're nearsighted. Yes, I'm nearsighted. I think、uh, most people who wear glasses. Are nearsighted,、yeah. but there are some people who are farsighted. Right, and I think if you're farsighted, that means you can focus on things far away, but not so much close. Right, and people who wear glasses for being farsighted tend to. Uh, the glasses tend to make their eyes really big, or something like that. Yeah. So、uh, you can kind of tell by looking at people's glasses. That's what reading glasses do too. Ah,、uh, they do that as、yeah. well, indeed. And those are some of the problems. But also, we've got problems with focusing, which we talked about. Of course, your your digital camera is going to focus on a subject,、mm-hmm. so you've got to press the shutter release first, so it will focus on the subject, make、mm-hmm. it clear. And、uh, you can do that, of course, with your smartphone as well. And your eyes need to focus on things all the time as well. Now, other treatments are recommended for people with thin corneas,、mm. dry eyes, or other issues. So you might have some special circumstances when you have this procedure done.、Uh, they've got different kinds of procedures recommended for people who have thin corneas, which means the、uh, transparent layer over your eye is thin. 
thinner than normal. Okay, so it may not be so easy to cut it open and make that flap stick out and reshape the、uh, tissue underneath. You may to you may need to proceed in a different way, use a different kind of laser, or do it from a different angle or something、mm-hmm. like that. I'm not an ophthalmologist. I'm not quite sure. You also might have problems with dry eyes. You don't have so many tears, and so that. Will require a special procedure, or there might be some other issues as well. Too numerous to mention here. Right.、Uh, it was last year that I I saw a scary photo of my older brother. He had woken up from sleeping the night before, and his eye was completely red. It looked scary. He had detached his retina、Uh-oh. in his sleep. Ooh. Um, and if he hadn't gone to the hospital within five hours, he would have been blind in one eye.、Ooh. So be careful. Some weird things happen.、Uh, he's pretty young, so we were shocked. I was so scared、the、when I first、okay、saw it. Vision okay now, though. Yeah, he's great now. Normal twenty、um, twenty vision. Yeah, actually, all my brothers and sisters eventually had to get glasses, except for me. I'm the、okay. only one who went twenty twenty.、Uh, but yeah, he's good now. But those eye doctors are very very important. If you have dry Eyes, they can go in and work on your eye duct, D U C T, which、uh, is where the water that helps your eyes stay moist comes from. I have a friend who has that problem. A lot of people have eye issues, so our eyes are pretty important. Take care of them.、Okay. Now, if you're talking about the discoloration of the eye, I just mentioned my brother had a really red eye when his retina became detached.、Uh, discoloration means any color besides the color it should be. So, discoloration could be red. It could be I don't know some other color. You can have discoloration of different things, but.、Uh, Those things are pretty important. You have to watch. Now, however, it says people can get eye infections from contact lenses too, and these do nothing to correct vision problems permanently. That's right. If you wear contact lenses, just because you wear them every day doesn't mean eventually you won't have to wear them because they can correct your vision. Wrong. An, an infection is when some sort of germ gets in to your body, and here, of course,、uh, you're probably not washing your contact lenses enough. There's a cleaning solution. I know I watched my mother use to clean her contacts.、Uh, if you're not cleaning them really well. Uh, you can get an infection of the eye. Ooh, that's dangerous. You got to be careful there, but I'm sure they take all the proper precautions there. But、uh, you know, every once in a while, someone might get an eye infection. But they're saying here that、uh, you can get those infections as well from contact lenses. Yeah. So yeah, if you wear contact lenses, you could get infected too. So totally, there's really no big difference there. And、uh, these do nothing to correct vision problems permanently,、mm-hmm. which means the problem goes. Way. Yes, you get the infection. It probably hurts a lot. You have to take some painkillers or something like that, or use special eye drops. But it's not permanent. And permanently here is an adverb.、Uh, they will not affect your vision permanently. It will be temporary, and you'll be seeing just as good or just as well as everybody else pretty soon. <laughs> Now, overall, laser vision correction achieves a satisfactory result. Satisfactory result in more than ninety-five percent of patients. That's pretty darn good. Many of whom describe the outcome as life-changing. I had a music professor in college that went through LASIK after years and years of wearing very thick. Glasses. We'd call them Coke bottle glasses. Yep. When the lens is very, very thick,、um, satisfactory results means you're happy with them. Your money. Let's <laughs> just say it in Chinese.、Um, in more than ninety-five percent, that's really good、uh, because anything can happen in surgery. You know, you may have the best surgeon in the world. It might not be his fault or her fault. It might be your body reacting strangely or doing something weird. Weird, but sometimes surgery goes awry, or there's a problem that happens during surgery. But here, I think these results、uh, are pretty、um, 
pretty、uh, pretty good and can give you a lot of confidence to go ahead and go through with some of this stuff.、Uh, many of the patients who go through laser surgery describe the outcome. The outcome is simply the results of something they've gone through as life changing. Pretty good. Changes your life, indeed. You don't have to wear those glasses anymore. You can see lots of things.、Uh, maybe you get inspired to change your life even beyond that. Wow! With such vision like this, I can do more. I can achieve more. So they say it's life changing. Or maybe you just look more beautiful or handsome, and you get more dates. That's always good too. Could be,、yeah. indeed. I wonder if the opposite is true. I remember a couple of years ago,、uh, glasses without lenses were quite <laughs>、yeah. uh, popular. I wonder if people actually. Wanted to make their vision worse, so they could actually put lenses in those glasses <laughs> as some sort of fashion statement. I wouldn't doubt somebody had thought of that. I always wanted glasses when I was young. So when I first came to Taiwan, I was only 21. I bought some glasses that had clear. Glasses, you know, in the frames,、right. just so no, I could wear glasses like no, everybody. No degree or no no subs- prescription. prescription. Yeah. yeah, that's that's how we say that. That's another thing we could talk about too. <laughs> like people, oh, ni ni o jin shi ni ji du. Yeah,、uh, I don't know how to say that in English.、Uh, you're nearsighted.、Uh, what's your prescription or something? Yeah,、But、how bad are your eyes? Yeah, how bad are your eyes? But most people really don't know their numbers, you know, because the、uh, U.S. uses a different system. But in any case,、uh, back. To this、uh, article here, they're saying there's a satisfaction result of 95 percent. The outcome is life changing, and of course, it's essential. It's important to consult an ophthalmologist before you make a final decision. Sure.、Uh, consult means you talk to somebody to get some advice about something. You might consult with uh, uh, what do they call people who sell stocks?、Uh, a bank? Uh, what's what's stock it called? Stockbroker. Stockbroker. That's yeah. The one. Yeah. You might consult with a stockbroker、mm. uh, if. You want to invest in the stock market? Hey, what should I buy? You know, what should I invest in?、Mm-hmm. Stuff like that. In this particular case, yes, you want to talk to the ophthalmologist first to see first if this surgery is suitable for you, and if it can be easily done, and if it's within your budget, can your insurance pay for it, or if it doesn't, can you pay for it out of your pocket, and how much is it going to cost, etc., etc. Now, of course, this whole article was supposedly written by an eye doctor. And at the end, it sums up by saying, "I would certainly recommend it." That's laser correction surgery. I would recommend it to anyone troubled by vision problems. Some people don't mind wearing glasses or, you know, wearing contacts. A lot of people wear those throwaway or one day contact lenses or one week. I think they're called disposable yeah, contact disposable, lenses. Disposable, yeah. Some people, you know, don't mind it. So whatever. But if you do, this is something. You could consider right now, guys. We're going to listen to our Chinese teacher, and then we'll be back to wrap up. Hi, everyone. My name is Jenny. 好，我们继续来看第六单元，谈的是 laser vision correction， 也就是镭射视力矫正手术。从医生的角度来看的话，有一些问题可能是病人常提的，所以接下来就一样一样的说给你听。好，那我们来看这个眼科医师哦。当然，被问问题的时候，总是会问说：“啊，到底该不该做镭射的矫正手术呢 ？”Whether they should undergo laser vision correction， 这个 whether 当然是是否，这引导出来的这个子句在这里是当名词子句来用哦。问谁什么事？哎，当做 ask。的受词，好，我们再来看这边，他提到要不要做这个手术，用到的动词是 undergo。undergo 当然有那种 experience 经历，哎，这个感觉在内。如果你 undergo something， 像在这边接手术也可以，表示要不要做动这个手术。接下来，下面就是医生的回答。医生的回答里面，好一样一样讲，所以很清楚的。一开始就是 first， 第一点要讲的就是，不是只有一种镭射视力矫正手术而已。当然，比较先进的，大家比较知道的，最先进的就是 LASIK。那当然，下面就要解释解释一下这个 LASIK 手术是怎么样一个过程啊？那提到有几个字是比较大家可能少见的，像哦，他手术过程里面他会。
用这个镭射，然后把一块角膜掀起来。这个角膜 cornea， 那提到 cornea 这个字，当然可能很多人也都不熟悉，所以看到后面 cornea 后头有一个逗点，逗点后面其实就是一个同位语的片语，说明角膜 cornea 到底是什么。好 ，the transparent outer covering of the eyeball。也就是直白的来讲，就是眼球外层的透明覆盖物。好，那这些说明之后，他讲到 LASIK 这个手术，它可以用来治疗近视啦、远视啦、对焦的问题。好，那当然还有其他的手术，所以后面就是用 other treatments。好，那 other treatments。其他的手术治疗可能就会用来矫正别的，像跛角膜、干眼症，还有其他问题等等。那谈完第一个方面的问题之后，还有另外一个问题，所以他用 second 第二个问题，那可能就是谈副作用了。好，提到副作用这句话 ，as with all surgeries。我们看到 as with， 心里就会想，哎，这个 as with 是什么意思呢？大家可能比较少用这个片语，但是 as 我们知道它有正如同 ，with 往往是谈一个情况，所以 as with blah 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 就是就像什么什么的情况一样。好，那接下来就说到，嗯，有一些风险哦。不管你动什么手术，其实都有风险。那有一些风险和这个还有副作用，它跟镭射矫正手术是有关的。那下面就会提到是哪一些的情形。不过这边先暂停，看到 associated with， 我们知道 associate 这个字就表示和什么有关。不过在这里用 ed。我们也晓得这是过去分词，那它前面如果我们把它加进一个 that， 然后再接一个 are that are associated with， 这样就会把这里变成关系子句，那结构上就会比较清楚。如果你把 that 去掉 ，are 也去掉，这边就变成一个分词 associated。那 associated 这个分词片语，当然就可以用来修饰。哦，前面这个名词，也就是 risks、side effects， 也就是和镭射视力矫正有关的风险、有关的副作用。好，那我们知道说，嗯嗯，其实基本上哈，这些。动了手术之后，可能有一些像干眼症，这边提到了 dry eyes, blurred vision, 视力模糊，还提到了 discoloration of the eye， 也就是眼球本身会变色，这些问题。可能就是所谓的副作用，这是在愈合过程的副作用。不过他这边眼科医师也告诉大家，可是其实你想想看，如果你不是动镭射手术，你戴隐形眼镜还是会感染，对不对？好，所以意思就是说，这个眼科医师告诉大家，开镭射手术，嗯，不要太害怕。所以最后就要下结论了。Overall， 整个总和来讲，他说到。嗯 ，laser vision correction， 镭射视力矫正，大概呢超过百分之九十的病人做了这个手术之后都是满意的。那我们再来看这个百分之九十的病人后面有个逗点，接着 many of whom describe the outcome as life changing。看到 many 这个不定代名词，然后再看到 of whom， 当我们知道 whom 是受格，在接系词后面 of 后头一定是受格。只是我们用到 many of whom 这样的句构，我们也看得出来，它是一个关系子句，而用不定词代名不定代名词放在前面的时候，这样子的句构。一定有逗点隔开，一定要用非限定用法。那指的就是前面这些病人当中，很多人嗯都说这个结果真是改变了他们的人生啊。换句话说，是非常满意的。在这百分之九十五的人的身上，他们有很多人都满意。OK， 我们今天的讲解就到这边结束，我们下次见。We're going to take a quick break. Stay tuned. We'll be right back.
Okay, now that we've finished explaining our lesson for today and for our last time,、uh, we've got some discussion questions here, all about. Eye laser surgery. So here's the first question: Would you ever get laser vision correction? Let's say Stephanie that you did、mm-hmm. have vision problems.、Right. You don't have 20/20 vision. Just、uh, suppose that you had some kind of vision problem. Would you consider getting this surgery?、Um, no one in my family has ever gotten it. Though no one in my family has really bad vision either.、Um, I don't know. It sounds scary to me. I know they're really good at it now. <laughs> But the idea of being awake during the surgery is not very appealing to me.、Mm. Now, what about you? Would this help you at all with your vision? Uh, well, it might, but、uh, I would have to know if it can handle astigmatism. Oh,、yeah. I used to know how to say that in Chinese. I kind of forgot, but、uh, I would have to know if it can handle that problem because、uh, my problem with astigmatism is quite severe,、hmm. and so I would need to know if that's the case. But、uh, still. Uh, I'm used to wearing glasses, and I also like the fact that my glasses have transitions in them,、mm-hmm. which means they change color in the sunlight,、yeah. which I don't think they can do with the corneas of no, your eyes. No, of course not. So I like the <laughs> fact that、uh, you know, if I step out on a sunny day, my glasses will get darker. Oh, so, you don't have to put on sunglasses. No, they function as sunglasses. They're not ideal. Sometimes they don't get dark enough, or in、uh, cold climates they get too dark.、Mm-hmm. But for the most part, it's nice. Nice to know that I don't have to be switching back and forth between glasses and sunglasses. Yeah. Okay. So here's the second question, Tom. Do you prefer to wear glasses or contact lenses? Give reasons for your answer. Well, I tried to wear contact lenses once, but I just couldn't get them in my eye. I、Were、just they... couldn't do it. I kept blinking, and I finally got so frustrated that I gave up. Were they soft or hard?、Uh, they were soft.、Uh, I remember years ago, people would choose between soft contacts or hard contacts.、Yeah. I think most people choose soft contacts nowadays because they're more comfortable. Totally. Hard ones are probably hard to get used to, but、uh, I would not wear contact lenses, and I. Think that、uh, contact lenses don't really work if you have astigmatism,、mm-hmm. which I mentioned before. I'm sorry, I forgot how to say that in Chinese.、Mm. But in any case, yeah, I would not consider contact lenses. And as I said in the last question, I'm used to wearing glasses. It's okay, although sometimes I accidentally sit on them and have to get new. Lenses in them, but for the most part, <laughs> I don't mind wearing glasses. How about you? If you had to wear glasses, yeah, I think I've always seen you with glasses. I don't think I've ever seen you without glasses.、Mm. I don't need glasses, and so、um, if I did need to wear glasses to see. Um, I think I'd prefer glasses to contact lenses. Although, if I were to go on a date, I would probably want contact lenses because、uh, you can see eyes better that way. And eyes are always great. So,、mm. yeah, I'm grateful so far. I don't have to wear glasses. Someday I'm going to have to wear those old people glasses called reading glasses to see.、Mm. But right now I'm cool. Or bifocals or progressive lenses. Yeah.、Uh, yes, I've got those myself. But I've got a special condition where my eyes aren't straight, so I've only got progressive lenses in my left lens. Oh yeah. Not in the right. But I do have transitions in both lenses for the sunglasses Sun, effect.、Uh-huh. Even though I mostly use my left eye to see. But that's another question. I think we've、uh, beat this subject. Into the ground here, and uh, yes, uh, hopefully some of you will consider getting laser vision correction. But remember, a consultation with an ophthalmologist should be done first. Okay, that brings us to the end of our lesson for today. Thank you so much for joining us, and make sure you join us again next time. From all of us here at English Digest, I'm Tom. I'm Stephanie. Goodbye. Bye.